guys, welcome back to I Love Dogs. Today, um, since I have a headband business, I'm going to be showing you guys what I do, like what I use to make them. I'm not going to show you how I make them yet, but I'm going to do that in a separate video. So, let's just get started. So, the first thing I'm going to show you guys is all the flowers. So, I put them all on here. I don't want them to fall off. So, the first big flower is this polka dot one. I'm just going to go this really do this really quick. I have this gray one, this pink polka dot one with little polka dots, this big black one with white polka dots, this really pretty gray one, this gray one with a white flower thing in the middle. I don't really know what that is. Just like a little button that has that someone sewed over or something. And then there's this black one with jewels in it in the middle. <clears throat> there's this pink one. Oh, whoop. pink rose. This blue flower with whatever they're called, jewel things. And this little black one with the pearl in the middle. There's a small blue one. There's also a big version of this, but I don't have that right now. And there's this pink one. And there's this white version. And there's this blue rose. There's this white polka dot flower with black polka dots. And then there's this white flower that has a lot of petals on it. And there's a sparkly bow. I have lots of these. There's like 50 or 100. And there's like 50 of these silver roses. <clears throat> so right now I'm going to show you the headbands that I've already made that are mine. So here's this one big rose one and it has a black a black stretchy elastic and it has a gem in the middle and I have this one which I glued gems all around it I think it's really pretty and also there's this one that I'm wearing right now it's got um there's a little mini gray flower on top of a light pink one with a jewel on it and it has gray elastic I also have another headband but I don't know where that went it has um, two black roses, no, no, one black rose in the middle, and then there's two roses with, um, that look like this. It's sparkly like that. <clears throat> now I'm going to show you guys all the different colors of elastic I have. So the first elastic I have is this white elastic. And I have this green elastic. I haven't opened it yet. This is for St. Patrick's Day that I got it for. And then dark pink. There is black. This is cream. It's kind of hard to tell the difference between that and the white, but these are cream. And there's this tealish color. I don't really know what the color is, but it looks like that. Or a light, you could call it light blue. And there's dark blue. I'm not trying to go too quick so you can't see it, but. Then there's light pink. And then I have a bunch of gray. So that's all of the elastic I have. And then the ribbon I have. I have the sparkly kind that I just showed you. I have this gray kind, and I have this green kind. I will probably do a tutorial on how to make um, roses like this, but I don't really have enough ribbon to make one this big again. So I'm probably just gonna show you guys how to make a mini one unless I get thick, like thicker ribbon like this. <sighs> So then the other things I have to show you guys is back there, like right there. So this my mom got on Amazon with my money. Um, it's a bunch of felt for if like these flowers don't have like the little felt circles on the back. And so that's what these are. There's probably maybe 50 or 100. I don't really know how many there are. And then I also have these big felt circles. These are pretty big. It wouldn't really fit on this mini flower. It just like 
like that. And the last thing I have, ugh, I have these bubble mailers because you obviously need mailers to mail them out. So what I basically do to mail the headbands off, I use like tissue paper and um, I just wrap them up carefully and then I put them in a bubble mailer and then I just write the address, write the name and my address and just go to the post office and mail it off. So that's basically all I have for you guys today. And I will be doing a tutorial on how to make mm, little roses. And I might do a tutorial on how to make a big rose if I get the ribbon. And I probably will show you a tutorial on how to make a headband also. I use it on my sewing, I make the headbands on my sewing machine. So I will probably make a video of that for you guys. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you did, please give it a big thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe, comment, and I'll see you in another video, which will probably be a tutorial on how to make something. So um, thank you guys for watching. Bye.